Oh my goodness, those udders. Oi, okay.
classics and some white rocks. But she's just adorable. Okay, you guys are starting to pick on me. Uh, we need kelp and oyster shells. But if you follow this line straight down the pasture, all the way to the end of the pasture, right? So this is the line, right? This is where the chickens were, all the way down the pasture. Can you see that that whole strip is greener? It's more dark green. Now it's not as lush because it's just growing back, but can you see that it looks better already just from one pass? I can see it. They said put chicken litter on my pastures to make my hay pasture better. Can't think of a better way. going for a ride but I can't drive hold these and you all at the same time I can try I'm not sure how well it'll work out but here we go who was that who did that who just crowed Oyster 
are so smart, Missy Rescue. You knew. You were like, nah, we've already been out to do the chicken. She's gonna go fast and I'm gonna just tucker myself out trying to keep up with her. You are so smart, old girl. I have a really good idea that involves him. Let me get set up. You guys are gonna get a kick out of this. So I have been brushing and brushing and brushing on him and King is a, he's a Dorper sheep. Uh, he is a hair sheep, but this is his first spring shed and uh, so I go out and I brush on him or I, you know, pull some hair out. There's a little pile of hair over there that I pulled out this morning. But it's just not going as, you know, fast as I'd like. And I think the poor guy's got to be hot with all that dead hair on him. And it's driving me nuts. So I have the best idea. That dryer is the exact same blow dryer that they use on sheep and cows, just has a different sticker on it. So we're gonna see how it works. Not perfect, but we got a bunch out of him. So I was really hoping it was just gonna fold off, but 
No such luck. You're fluffy anyway. <laughs> oh, that was fun. And that is it for our fun adventures for today, you guys. Uh, I hope that you had a laugh. I hope I made you think. Uh, I hope that you felt inspired. And at the very least, I hope you just enjoyed your time here on our farm. So I hope you have a great day. And I will catch you on the next one. Yours truly.